Hi guys, this is Fred from WP Shout, and today I'm going to show you what to do if you want to modify a JavaScript file that's running in a WordPress parent theme. So you've got a JavaScript file that's running in your parent theme and you want to change the way it works and you want to do that in a child theme so that if you ever update the parent theme, you don't lose your changes. And today I'm going to show you how to do that. So let me show you the setup we've got. This is um, a site that works on my local machine, which is why I can use all these um, folders to, to modify files instead of having to go through FTP. And what we've got is we've got um, a JavaScript that I wrote running in the parent theme that says parent script running. Um, so it's just this, this very, very simple JavaScript file, obviously, that, um, that we have enqueued in the parent theme. So we did a WP and Q scripts and this long function in Q parent theme script that needs modification. And um, we've enqueued it with the tag parent script to modify and then um, a link to its location in the parent theme and the fact that it's dependent on jQuery. So let's just find it in the source of this page. Parent script. Okay, there it is. And you can see that it's coming in um, towards the top of the page. All right, so what we want to change it to is um, this child script that is present in the child theme. Um, and all it does is it says child script running. So how are we going to make that change? Well, what we're going to do is we're going to go into the functions.php of the child theme. And we are going to do we're going to go through a two-step process, but it's all going to come in the same add action call. So um, we're going to um, hook onto WP and Q scripts, and we're going to write this function with just an obscenely long name. I mean, you can name your functions whatever you want. I'm, I'm only doing this so that you understand what the function does. It dequeues the parent theme script, and then it enqueues the child theme script. And this 100 means that this happens after all the other stuff that happens with WP and Q scripts. So, so you want that because it means that even if there's a lot of other stuff that happens, this code will definitely run. Okay, so the two steps are we're going to dequeue, meaning remove um, the script whose tag is parent script to modify. And as I showed you, you can't actually really see the tag in the page source, it doesn't show up. It doesn't have like an ID the way that like a, um, a CSS style sheet does. Um, let me just try to show you what I'm talking about. You see how a CSS style sheet has an ID like this? Well, JavaScript, JavaScripts don't. Um, so how you have to find the tag is you have to go into the parent, you have to go into the place where the script was actually enqueued and you have to see what that first argument was. So the tag of the script in the parent theme is called parent script to modify. So we're going to copy that. And that's the script that we're going to dequeue. And um, it has this function has no other arguments. That's all you do. So, so far, we've removed the parent script, right? So now if you see if we reload, nothing happens, there's no neither of the scripts are running neither the script nor in the parent nor in the child. Now the next step is that we are going to in queue the script from our location. So it's called modified child script. And we're going to point to it with get style sheet directory URI, which points to its URL in the child theme. And then the JS folder and then its, um, um, its uh, file name, which is modified child script.js. So we've removed the parent script. Now we've enqueued or added the child script. And now when we reload, it says child script running. So this is just the sort of quick um, version for how to um, take a JavaScript file that's working almost the way you want in a parent, but there's something about it you want to change, and to remove it out of the um, out of the um, set of scripts that are enqueued, but to also re-enqueue a script that's almost exactly like it, but that lives in your child theme. Um, cool. Uh, I hope this was helpful to you, and thanks for watching.